Our lesson today is about lenses. Objectives. At the end of this presentation, the student should be able to differentiate between converging and diverging lenses according to the shape, path of the emergent rays, and the image formed by the lens. Define shadow. Lenses. A lens is a transparent medium tied between two surfaces, functioning on the basis of refraction of light. There are two types of lenses, converging lens and diverging lens. Converging lens and diverging lens. Converging lens. Thin at edges and thick at the middle. Diverging lens. Thick at the edges and thin at the middle. Converging lens. When a beam of light is incident on a converging lens, the emergent rays converge. Diverging lens. When a beam of light is directed on a diverging lens, the emergent rays diverge. Image formed by a converging lens. We observe a candle by a converging lens at different distances as shown in the figures. In the first figure, the size of the image is smaller than the size of the candle and the image is inverted. In the second figure, the size of the image is bigger than the size of the candle and the image is inverted. In the third figure, the size of the image is bigger than the size of the candle and the image is erect. Image formed by a diverging lens. We observe a candle by a diverging lens at different distances as shown in the figures. In the first figure, the size of the image is smaller than the size of the candle, and the image is erect. In the second figure, the size of the image is smaller than the size of the candle, and the image is erect. In the third figure, the size of the image is smaller than the size of the candle, and thus the image is erect. As a conclusion, converging lens, thin at the edges and thick at the middle while diverging lens thick at the edges and thin at the middle. In case of converging lens, emergent rays converge, while in case of diverging lens, the emergent rays diverge. In case of converging lens, the image may be inverted or erect. In case of inverted image, the image size may be smaller than or greater than or equal to the size of the object. In case of erect image, the image size is always greater than the size of the object. In case of diverging lens, the image is always erect image and its size is smaller than the object size. Shadow. What happens when the light is directed toward an opaque body? Consider the source of light S and a wall and an opaque body between the wall and the source of light. When light is directed toward the opaque body, shadow appears on the wall. So, what is shadow? Shadow is the region that results when the light is blocked by an opaque body. And shadow takes the shape of the opaque body that blocked the light. Thank you.